All right, you guys, this is a Tuesday morning haul, and I'm super excited about something. Um, I'm going to start with the paper, which is mainly what I got with paper. I went to a different Tuesday morning than my normal one. So I bought this <clears throat> Echo Park Fall Break, and it is from 2018. I actually think it's a Cardabella. Um, Echo Park just rebranded it because obviously that says Cardabella, but um, thought that was cute. <clears throat> <coughs> Got this one, Celebrate Christmas, and I think I might already have it, but it was too cute to leave behind again. So that's 2018 as well. And there's the sticker sheets. Excuse my allergies, you guys. This one, Let It Snow. I have not seen this one before. And it is from 2018 as well. That's another Cardabella. Rebranded by Echo Park. So I like that. Then I got the Low Fall. If I can get it up. <clears throat> That's 2017. Again, I might have this one, but I like it. And this one I know I have, but I used it, a lot of it, and I love this one from Echo Park. And it was from 2018. It was one of my favorites. And I don't like Halloween, so this was cute. So I got another one of those. So now I can finish the one that I started. And this is Authentique, it's called Dublin. It was $10. I wouldn't have paid $24 for it. I hated even paying 10, but I guess they charge the extra because those cards are in there. But my nephew's wife <laughs> always wanted to go to Ireland. So I thought this would be a cute paper pack to do something with for her. If nothing else for St. Patty's Day. Then the rest of these are these 25 pack sheets. Uh, this one is from Sparkle City. And I got it because I like that. Which I'll share some of that. This one is from The Mask Love Wild Card. I've never heard of that brand until I was watching a crafting with Liller haul video she did a couple days ago. I'd never heard of it. And then I found this. This one is called Squeeze the, D the Day. So there's that side and that side. There was another one too for Damask Love, which is this one. From Wildcard as well. Always on point. So there's the cacti, and I like that side. Um, this is another Damask Love from the same collection, Wild Card. Love this paper. And there's the back side, which that's cute too. So very usable, all on both sides of that. Then I got this Bow Bunny. From province, but I got it for the script. I'm a sucker for script. So I like that. And then these two are from Pebbles. They're boy and girl paper. Whoops, upside down. Um, which they're both cut apart, which I liked. Cute for baby cards or baby journals. Again, I'll probably share, but it's got the safety pins on the back. Um, the design, some of the designs are different. Different, Some of them are the same, so. Um, but there's a little boy one. And there's the back side. So that's the paper. Then I've been looking for one of these and finally found it. This, um... Whatever it's called. This thing that makes lets you um, curl your 
like flower leaves and I was going to use it for ribbon. So whatever it's called, there it is. And this was what I was most excited about. Apparently, Lawn Fawn is coming to Tuesday morning. I only found one stamp and I went to another one. They didn't have any. This is the only one I found. But I was super excited. Um, and it's September of this year. So hopefully we'll start seeing some Lawn Fawn in our stores. So I'm excited about that because I don't have this one, obviously. But anyway, so that is my Tuesday morning haul with my super excited find. And I'll come back with a Hobby Lobby. Thanks.